toad in a teapot. Little Hoot and Flea were going to visit Grandma Natterjack. You're sure your grandma doesn't mind us coming? Little Hoot asked the baby toads. No, she loves having visitors. They did not see why Willy Commodo and the baby hiding nearby. Are we going to pounce now, Dad? asked Baby. No, I have a much better plan, said Willy. You are going home, and I shall have to hurry if I am to beat them to Grandma's house. Grandma Natterjack was struggling with her big teapot and did not hear Willy come in. Will you like a hand with that? he asked. Why, thank you. Oh, Grandma gasped when she saw who it was. What are you doing here, Willy Commodo? I've come to put you in the teapot, said Willy, and he did just that. When Little Hoot and his friends arrived, Willy was fast asleep and snoring. Shh, said Little Hoot. Grandma's asleep. Let's make the tea for her, said the toads, and give her a nice surprise. Just then, the teapot gave a loud sneeze. Coo, said Flea. A sneezing teapot. They lifted the lid. Grandma, cried the toads. So who's that? said Little Hoot. Everyone turned to look at the slipper on the table. It's Willy Commodo, said the flea. How about if we bake some special cookies for Willy when he wakes up? Flea suggested. She began collecting ingredients from Grandma's cupboards. Hmm, pepper, chilli powder... And I think Willie like a nice hot cup of tea too. Hee <laughs> hee. Hello, Grandma, said a little toad in Willie's ear. What? Willie sat up. Ah, you're here. What's happened to your voice, Grandma? Willie suddenly remembered he was supposed to be Grandma. Oh, nothing, he said in a squeaky voice. Just a, a little frog in my throat. We baked some special cookies for you, Grandma said Little Hoot. Oh, you shouldn't have, said Willy, reaching for the plate. Aren't you going to have one? After you, said Flea, Willy smiling at the little toads as he began to munch on a cookie. What polite friends you have. Hmm, this is absolutely hot. Ah, I'm on fire. Oh dear, said Little Hoot. Cup of tea, perhaps? Uh, Yes, yes, anything. Gasped Willy. Ah, that's worse. Get me some water. There's a pond in the garden, said a helpful young toad. Willy sprinted out of the door and dived into the lily pond to cool his mouth. Back at home, Little Hoot and Wide Eye all about their visit. Well, Little Hoot, said Wide Eye, trying hard to look stern. That wasn't a very nice thing you did. But I should think Willy learnt his lesson. Ha ha, hoo hoo. And then Wide Eye, Little Hoot and Flea laughed and laughed. The end.